guys, it's Megan or Mad Little Crafter here, and today I have another Amigurumi update for you. I forgot which one this was, but here we go anyways. First, I have this little pink donut that I made. It was just a random donut, whatever. I made a bunch of these popsicle keychains. They are all available on my Etsy store. The link will be down in the description box below. I think I made around 10 of them and they all come on these little cell phone straps with these little made with love charms. There's a bunch of different colors. Um, some of my favorites are the striped ones that I'm showing first. And I also made a creamsicle one and a chocolate one that will be shown later on. And then this is also a popsicle, but it's on a little hair clip. I went ahead and stitched the hair clip into the backing so it's really secure. Even though it moves back and forth a little bit like that, I promise you it is 100% secure. <laughs> that is also available on my Etsy store. I also made this little tiny BB-8 Amigurumi. This is the first one I made. I've already sold a couple of them as made to order. They are on my shop as well. little tiny mermaid chibi that I made. I don't know, I just felt like making a mermaid and I ended up making her really teeny tiny and I really love how she turned out. I also made a tiny chibi of blue diamond right after, um, I forgot what episode it was, but one of the Steven Universe episodes came out. I just loved her design so much. Along the theme with Blue Diamond, I also made Blue Pearl. You can watch me make her in my Watch Me Crochet episode 1, which will be linked in the little i card up in the top right hand corner. You'll see that pop open. I love her hair, it's so soft. I also have this little fairy chibi. She is on my Etsy store as well. It's going to be a first in a line of fairies. They're all going to be 100% original designs and I'm only going to make one. I also have this No Face from my collab with Clay Collectibles. I will link her YouTube and her Instagram in the description box below. Hi, Rebecca. <laughs> then I have this little tiny Charmander. I made him to help a friend crochet. Her name's Britt. I will link her channel below as well. And also I have this little teeny tiny barn owl that I made and he's wearing a Slytherin scarf. I need to make the others for the other uh, three houses, but he has a little clip on the bottom so he can sit on your shoulder, and I thought that was super fun. I'm going to wear him when I go to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, hopefully sometime soon. And then the biggest one is this dinosaur who I've named Sprinkles. I made him using Blue Phone Studios Timothy the T-Rex pattern. You can see me trying to struggle to get him into frame here. You can see the back of my filming fabric, so professional. But he is so big and so squishy and I love him very much. She sells this pattern on her Etsy store, which I will also link down below with everything else. He's got little nubby arms. <laughs> well, that's it for this crochet update, guys. Thanks for watching. Go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye!